Strictly Come Dancing features all over the world. And where are we off to today? Ireland, of course. Why else would I be wearing a shamrock on my head? Ireland's version of Strictly is called Dancing with the Stars, and the first series aired in January of this year. Tonight, the world's most popular dancing extravaganza has reached Ireland. Welcome to Dancing with the Stars! Yeah. Like Strictly, the series proved to be a big hit, and in June, it was announced that it would be returning for a second series. Now, there are a few familiar faces from the Strictly family on the show, including one of the presenters, Nicky Byrne, who got to the Strictly quarterfinals in 2012. I've come to meet him to find out a little bit more about the show. So you were a contestant on Strictly Come Dancing, but now you're hosting it. Yeah, it's when I heard the rumors last year that Dancing with the Stars was coming to Ireland. I was like, I've got to be a part of this somehow. You host the show with someone else, don't you? Amanda Byram. Yes, Amanda's from Ireland originally. You know, nothing will phase her. Near the end, actually, on the final show, they asked myself and Amanda to do a part of the group dance. So we didn't have much of a rehearsal. Like, it was only a few hours. Do you think I got it right, Jeanette? Oh no, no Karen, that one moment. Karen would not be proud of I know, Nikki. I know. <laughs> I stopped. Oh, I've messed this up. I think I made a mistake in the dance, but we won't tell anybody. No, 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 say nothing to no one. <laughs> no wonder I didn't win Strictly. <laughs> What are the judges like here versus the judges over there? Pretty similar. Um, we have uh, Lorraine Barry. We also have uh, Brian Redmond. We have a, a guy called Julian Benson. Uh, but Brian would be the nasty one. He's a bit too wiggly at times and maybe even difficult to stomach at moments as well. Oh. I always have the guys back, you know. I, You've been there, Exactly, yeah. and you know how it feels. I think it went well for where we I thought went. We thought we didn't share the mistakes. Tell me a little bit about some of the most memorable moments. This guy called Huey Mon, who had been on uh, Big Brother in the UK, and he decided to apply fake tan himself continuously. So when we kept going to ad break, the producers were coming over to him saying, Huey, you have to stop. I want to start off by asking, how tanned is tanned? You can never be too tanned. There's oh no such God. thing. He actually put the show in such a high profile. It appeared on American chat shows, it appeared in the UK press. What's this guy in Ireland doing with his face on Dancing with the Stars? <laughs> By the way, Kiwi, you're trending on Twitter, we don't know what. No. <laughs> now, what a lot of you probably don't know is that the pro dancers have to start rehearsing the group dances months in advance. And luckily for us, the pros in Dublin started rehearsing this week, so I thought I'd go and take a look. Strictly's very own AJ Pritchard's not-so-little brother is a professional dancer on the Irish Dancing with the Stars. Tell me a little bit about your partner last season. Uh, last season I had a model uh, named Talia. How far did you get with your partner? Week two. Ah. <laughs> oh. Yes. This year, Hopefully sorry. this year, yeah, we're going to be until the final and we're going to win it. It's going to be great, yeah. You're quite tall, though. You're going to need a tall one, aren't you? Yeah, I don't know where I've come from because AJ is absolutely... <laughs> AJ's slightly yeah. different. All right, fingers crossed then. There's more familiar faces here too. Strictly pros and champions Darren Bennett and Lilia Kopolova are the creative producer and choreographer on the show. I want to know more than anything, what are the biggest differences between the Irish Dancing with the Stars and Strictly? Yeah, we have some lovely themes. Last year we had a Valentine's week, which was really beautiful. Uh, we also have the Irish week, of course, St. Patrick's Day. The river dance coming in and perform. Uh, the energy they produce is unbelievable. We also have the switch up which means, of course, the couples get to dance with another partner. During that episode, it creates different stresses. Uh, we get jealousy. Jealousy. Uh, if you had to pick between Ksenia and Karen, uh, no, we won't ask that question. We'll ask that. <laughs> and what have been some of those like most memorable moments for you? Contemporary ballroom, oh. which is a really nice mix of contemporary dance and different ballroom styles. Des Carhill, famous sports commentator, doing his famous Paso Doble and right. Austin Powers number. So yeah, we had some really, really standout moments and I'm very much looking forward to season two and there's a lot Coming of work back. to do between now and yeah. then. It's so exciting to see another series of Dancing with the Stars getting underway. And I was going to wish them good luck, but as the Irish say, if you're lucky enough to be Irish, then you're lucky enough. <laughs>